Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at a clock. Um, it's actually a pretty special clock. Uh, it comes in this box here. So it's pretty simply packaged. We got a is to be the charger for this thing. And the clock itself. Okay, we do have some more stuff in there. Let's see what that is. Okay, this is very strange. It's a <laughs> Sticker USB barcode, I guess for resale maybe. And we got some instructions in the wrong language, of course. So we do have some English here. Alright, so I guess if we do need that, that's actually a lot of writing up, so hopefully it's not that complicated. Anyway, let's get to the clock here. Alright, so this must be the back. Let's see what the front looks like. Oh, look at that. Actually, not sure where the top is. Maybe it, maybe it is like this. Let's see. Okay, so this is where the batteries would go. And you get one, two, three, four AA batteries. But we're going to probably just use the USB here. Okay, so all this stuff is upside down. So that makes me think that it goes like that. Yeah, but... But we do have a little bit of defects here, but it's not bad. Actually, it looks pretty good. So let's get this cable here, plug it in, and see what happens. All right, guys, so I got the cable plugged in into the power source, and now we're just going to plug it in and see if we can see anything. There we go. Wow. Okay, for some reason on the screen of the camera, it must be the refresh rate. Um, this is actually solid right now. It's not blinking. Wow, that actually looks really good. I'm surprised. It's very nice. Alright guys, so I adjusted the camera a little bit so it wouldn't flicker like that. So you guys can see what that looks like. That's actually very nice. Oh, there it goes flickering again. There we go. I guess it just depends on the lighting. <laughs> Camera's trying to be all smart. Okay, we need extra exposure to stop the blinking. Anyways, guys, this this is pretty awesome looking. As you can see, this is a uh, pretty fancy. And it really makes the desk look nice. I'm actually pretty surprised. Put it over here out of curiosity. Let's just say I had it right there. Yeah, that's really cool. That actually looks very nice. Alright guys, so let's go over some of the features here because um, I was a little bit confused about how to operate this thing. But I'm going to go over just a few real quick of the main ones that are pretty important, obviously. So, um, the first thing is, you know, it's off right now, as you can see. So, if you want this feature on and off, you can turn this off. You can, it can be continuously on if you want it to. So right now, if you make a sound like clap your hands, it turns on. Or if you just touch it anywhere around here, it also comes on. But after a few seconds, it'll come back off. So to turn this feature on and off, what you're going to do is you're going to hold the down button. So you get this menu that says SD. So you either as it basically stands for sound. So if it's on, then it's gonna it's gonna turn itself off. So if it's not on like that then it's gonna stay on so if now it's just gonna stay on so if you like your you know clock to stay on that's that's where you would adjust that alright so the next feature is if you wanted to do manual adjustment of the brightness honestly you'd probably never mess with this unless you you know want it brighter for some reason it's actually automatic and it when it gets to p.m. when it gets to later at night I don't know exactly it might know exactly uh, when it gets dark so it kind of dims itself but in any case um, if you hold the up button you can force the uh, manually the brightness as you can see here so that's kind of cool so obviously it's on the brightest now but it was actually low at night and it, it just turned itself bright during the day so the only thing I can see is that at night if this even on the lowest brightness if it's still too bright for you which is not that bright honestly you know, you can turn it to voice there, and, you know, it'll turn itself off. And if you need it, you can just clap. All right, so if you push the up button, which is the middle one here, just one time, that changes the Celsius and Fahrenheit. So that's pretty simple enough. So the next button you got here is set. 
and if you just push that without holding it, just push it, you're going to have a display one. And what it does is, is oscillates between the date and the time here. So it'll change actually this and this here in a second, and you'll see that. There it goes. So that's your year and your date. And then it'll go back to the other times. So if you click the set button again, and you put a DP2, display 2, that'll just keep it on this screen the whole time. So that's the main features. Um, to get to the rest of them, you hit the set button and hold it. And then you get to adjust all your things. So the year, the date, I'm just clicking the set button. 20, 12 hours or 24 hours. And then you got alarm one. And then you can set it. Alarm two. And then you can set it. And alarm three. And then you can set it. So the E is basically if you click it on, it it does not ring on the weekends. So I guess it knows its calendar. So once you enter the date, so if you don't want this to ring on the weekends, you turn it on. Yeah, the alarms, which is I guess Saturday and Sunday. So anyways. That's pretty much everything. It's definitely a very unique clock. I really like it, honestly. It looks great on the desk. Um, you can put batteries in there so you don't have this wire. So yeah, I'm very pleased with it. And uh, I think it's a good value. It looks modern and I love the, uh, the finish on this thing. It's really nice. Anyways guys, hopefully you enjoyed this little review of this clock. So if you want to get a clock like this, I'll leave a link in the description. I think it's for about $20 or so. Alright guys, if you like this video, hit that like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this. Check out my other videos on this channel. And thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Peace.